Hi everyone, we're interviewing Burning from DK after the group stage of the International. So the first question is, why Burning? The first question is, why is Burning? Uh, one of his former girlfriends liked a song called Burning, so that's why. Okay. Uh, how is your English skill? Because in some interviews you started speaking English or replying English. Do you actually understand everything that I speak, for example? 你英语怎么样？因为以前见过你呃采访中用英文嘛，然后就问说他说的英文你现在都能听懂吗？呃，我英文挺差的吧，但是一些简单的还是可以听懂。His English is pretty bad, but some simple things he can still understand. Does he learn English in China? Or teacher? 你你平时会上英语课吗？什么的？其实，在学校的时候上过。just, just when he was in school. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, he mentioned that he played poker like one year ago. Does he play it now? I heard you I haven't played for a long time now. Okay, so. why? Is it uh, he lost some money or? Why <laughs> did uh, it was just a hobby, just for fun, but he wanted to concentrate on Dota, so stop playing. Mm, okay. Um, he also said that his girlfriend only gets very limited time from him, and they just play a few pub games per week. They can't even meet. I mean, Oh, does it change after the international? And yeah, his how is it going to like continue the, such relationships? I mean, I heard you say that uh, with your girlfriend, you can only so you can only meet her once a week, and you can only meet her once a week. So, after the international, you can't meet her once a week. So, after the international, you can um, yes, of course, because after every TI every year there's a long break, so more time to spend with girlfriend. And is it okay for her? Does she say constantly like, burning, come on, I need more time, something like that? She's pretty understanding. Uh huh. Okay. And what would you choose? Winning the international four or your girlfriend? <laughs> he understands, you see? You, you don't know. What? This is very hard to say. It's very hard to say. But come on. Try, try to, to make an answer. You need to answer. No answer. No answer. Okay. Um, in general, Dota in your life, now it, will, it has a big part. Do you think if you can come back, you'd still choose to play Dota? Or maybe go somewhere else, study another job and everything else? If I think uh, he thinks he will still choose Dota. Okay. Uh, alcohol and Dota. How is it in China? Because in our community some professional players, they drink, you know. It's Russia, of course. And uh, what about uh, China? How is it there? Uh, never, never, drink. yeah, never drink while playing, no. And after, can they just drink to relax a bit, or? Uh,一般拿到冠军的时候会去庆祝一下。
if if they win a championship, then go out and celebrate a bit. Okay. Um, what about tournaments before the International Four? Because before TI3, he even said that they were lacking tournaments in China. What about TI4? Did they have enough? Uh,TI三之前就是大家都说嘛,中国队伍可能缺乏比赛经验,因为比赛很少,那TI四之前这一段时间感觉这个情况又怎么样?呃,肯定是要比去年好很多的,今年中国队伍都参加了很多国外的
Recently I've read that it was because uh, they were not treating practice so seriously and that's why other teams refused to practice versus DK. How he can comment on that? Uh uh 就是平时用的东西，就是比赛里面会用到的，只是他们不习惯而已。呃，so he says that from their recent matches here, you can see that um their heroes that they pick and the lineups that they pick are basically what they also pick in training, but maybe the other teams they see it in training, it's something weird. They think it's weird, so they think it's not serious, but they're actually using it here, so that speaks for itself, maybe. And was there some uh, part of that boycott that uh, you have not Chinese players in your team? Because it was also a big rumor. Um可能吧。可能会是我觉得还有大部分原因可能就是啊你们说的嗯平时训练的东西比较奇怪。还有太多什么的可能觉得我们态度不好啊或者我们这一年成绩不错啊我觉得都有些原因吧。so maybe, um, but maybe the larger part of the reason is still because they think that what they pick in training is weird or because of their attitude or maybe even because their results this past year have been pretty good. So, mm -hmm. on, the t on the International 3 you said that you talked with Balba and Demon quite a lot and you discussed strategies and even after that you were chatting. What about the International 4? Did you find some new friends? TI三的时候听说你跟Demon和Bobba聊了很多,然后甚至聊到一些战术什么的,那请问你这次TI四有没有交到什么新朋友?好像还是Bobba和Demon跟我聊天比较多吧。Uh, uh, he thinks that it's still probably Demon and Bobo that chat the most with him. Okay. Um, what does he think about Alliance fall on the International 4? Because on the International 3 he described them as like the best team actually. TI3的时候你好像说过A队是最强,那这次TI4A队已经出局了,你对这个有什么评价? Um, 我觉得因为所有的队伍都在进步吧，而且A队还是在坚持他们TI3的打法，我觉得可能呃会不太适合这个版本吧。so uh, all the all the teams around are they're improving whereas uh, alliance they're still trying to hang on to the their same place or very similar place style as ti3 so that might not be very suitable for the current version what does he think about russian teams on the international uh,俄罗斯有几家,安排,呃,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,安排,
without using bands. Uh, he asked me about the C9 game. They often have a tone with a little bit of a tone. If you face this tone, how do you face it? Uh, it's a little bit of a tone. It's a little bit of a tone. I didn't even think about it. We just banned it. I didn't think about it, but maybe just ban it. Oh, come on. OK, OK, OK. Um, uh, you also mentioned that you're like the draft leader. Uh, is it actually hard to draft and then carry the game? Because it's a lot of thinking. Uh, definitely, uh, you have to think about a lot of things. You have to think about how you you are going to play. You have to think about how the opponents are going to play. Uh, it also influences the way you play your own hero. So it's uh, a huge amount of pressure. Does he also make in-game solutions like an uh, in-game captain? 那比赛中的指挥也是你，你，你是你做吗？嗯，之前是我比较多吧，现在我们有点改变。啊，previously uh, it was mostly him, but um, now they've made some changes. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, so the change is like, is it one person or now there, everyone is in, giving some input or how is it, what's the new system? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Okay. Um, they lost quite a lot of games in the group stage. What's the main reason? Uh, uh, 精神状态是一方面嘛，嗯，或者说班皮克也不好，啊，有些比赛，或者说因为一些失误说的都有吧。呃，all kinds of reasons, personally because like mental form, um, form wise, also drafts and also they made some mistakes. Um, who was the most emotional during these losses? 嗯，输比赛的话，谁会嗯最情绪化？那我也我比较多吧。Does so he himself okay. a bit more here? So how is he controlling himself then not to you know not to fight with start fighting with teammates or something? 那如果有有一点情绪的话，你会怎么调节？ 就是，呃，输掉的话，就是尽量不要去想上一场吧，只去想好怎么打好下一场比赛就可以。Mainly, uh, uh, if if you lose, just try your best not to think about the past game and try to focus on the next game, how to play that well. Okay, almost finished. Uh, what skill from Dota 2 do you want in real life? 嗯，最后一个就是问，如如果你能选一个Dota二的技能，在现实世界里生活里能用上，你会选哪个技能？嗯，我觉得啊，先知的那个技能还不错，飞、传送。uh, nature's prophet, teleport. Teleport. Yeah. Okay. Nice. And uh, the last, what's uh, more tasty, uh, mega creeps or Asian food? Asian food. Uh, 
Chinese food. <laughs> Chinese food. <laughs> said in English. Okay, uh, shout out sponsors, um, anything wanna add in the end? So, you may have to say that. Uh, thank you for TT Esports and Douyu TV. Thank you for your support. Thank you to our sponsors, TT Esports and Douyu TV. And uh, thank you to our, to our fans. Can he say something in English? Uh, thank you. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay, that was a nice ending. Thank you, Burning, for the interview, and see you guys.